Hey Gatsby, would you like to eat my food? Yes! Yes, I would! So we just picked up Chrissy Teigen's latest book, Cravings Hungry for More. Would you like me to make you one of Chrissy Teigen's meals? <laughs> yeah? I think we're gonna try making this one. Cheesy Chicken Milanese. Let's get started on the recipe. We're gonna make one for me and one for Gatsby. Can you do Chrissy Teigen's excited face? Place a chicken breast between two big sheets of plastic wrap using the smooth side of a meat pounder or an empty wine bottle. Pound the chicken as thin as you can without ripping it to shreds. Season with salt, black pepper, and cayenne and repeat with the remaining chicken breast. And Gatsby's will not be seasoned. Set up three shallow bowls, spread out flour in one, place the eggs in a second bowl, combine the breadcrumbs and panko in the third bowl and season with salt and black pepper. Interested to see how regular breadcrumbs mixed with panko breadcrumbs will really affect the chicken. It says it's supposed to be extra crispy. Place a quarter cup of the mozzarella on one side of each pounded chicken. Moisten the edges with the whole breast with water, then sprinkle a little flour, and then you just fold this over, pressing the edges to seal. We're using the flour and water to act like glue. I'm making some for you. Okay, this looks like the standard breading procedure. We're just gonna take some chicken, dip it in the flour, and then the egg wash, and then in the breadcrumbs. So have to remember which one's Gatsby's, because it goes on the top. My nose can smell something yummy. By the way, Gatsby's is just gonna be baked. I'm just deep frying mine. He's like, please, sir, Fissy Teigen's chicken. Transfer the cutlets to a baking sheet and finish cooking in the oven about 15 minutes. While we wait, we're just gonna cut up some tomatoes. Cut one of the halves into quarters. There we go. By the way, tomatoes are safe for dogs. It's just dogs don't really like eating them that much. Are you ready to eat some food, Gatsby? Top each one with a handful of arugula. Shave some Parmesan over each cutlet and drizzle with olive oil and balsamic. I'm plating it. You gotta wait a little bit. Very crispy. And here it is. Chrissy Teigen's Cheesy Chicken Milanese. And there's Gatsby's Baked Chicken with Cheese. Gatsby, do you want some? Yeah? Okay, we're gonna eat it. Here's Gatsby's and here's mine. Slicing your food up, Gatsby, so you can eat it in bite-sized pieces. Chicken and cheese, what could be better? Gentle, gentle. Is that yummy? Is that yummy? Wait, I can't. It's so yummy. Mmm. Mmm. It's a little bit spicy. I put kind of a lot of cayenne pepper. How is it, Gatsby? Is it yummy? So it's super crispy outside, and then inside it's like nice and cheesy. The parmesan on the top complements the chicken super well. Are you eating all your salad? <laughs> Panko breadcrumbs tend to taste a lot more light and regular breadcrumbs are a lot more hearty. Putting it together, get the best of both worlds. Acid from the tomatoes as well as the balsamic, super good. It was pretty simple to make too. So, what do you think, Gatsby? I guess he went for the tomatoes, didn't go for the arugula that much. Should we do the Chrissy Teigen excited face? And let me know if you think that I should try out any other celebrities' recipes with Gatsby. Yeah? If you like the video, make sure to subscribe and share with your friends. Our channel is mainly a vlogging channel. This is just something extra.